No one respects the Constitution more than I do. We have Article I authorities. There's a reason why the Founding Fathers put Article I first, because that's the American people over the imperial presidency. Why are we debating such an important issue? Matters of war and peace, which is what my committee argues day in and day out on Foreign Affairs Committee. Well, first of all, it's part of the NDAA, but why are we arguing this at 9.15 at night, in the darkness of night and not the sunlight of day? This is a dangerous amendment. It's a preemptive use of the AUMF. We have not engaged in hostile forces, combat forces in Iran. We have not engaged in hostilities. That is when the War Powers Resolution kicks in, notification to the Congress, and then Congress debates the authorization of use of military force. I've been in this body for eight terms. That is how the process works. You don't handcuff the president, the commander in chief, you don't handcuff him in advance of any preparation for dealing time with a expired. hostile state sponsor of terror, and this is just wrong. The gentleman yields back. The gentleman from Texas.